Hey everyone, it's Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share what's in my carry-on because I will be traveling to Hawaii really soon and I wanted to share how I pack my carry-on and just like some essentials that make traveling way easier. I'm also wearing one of the hoodies from my merch line and if you didn't know, I do have a little collection of clothing that I think is super cute and it also kind of helps spread awareness about going cruelty-free and everything. So if you wanna check it out, definitely look in the description box because I'll have a link there. So if you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe by hitting that subscribe button below this video and let's go ahead and get started. When I travel, I like to use a backpack as a carry-on because I find that it's just way easier to use and actually carry around and then you don't have to wait to get anything out of the overhead bin when you're actually leaving the plane. So lately, every time I travel, I just do a super easy backpack. It is kind of heavy because I like to put a ton of stuff in there, but that's just me. So the backpack that I like to use is from Target. It's quite a boxy shape, so it actually holds quite a bit of stuff. I'm pretty sure it was only around 25 to $30, so super affordable, and I love the color. I think it's so cute. I also really like this one because it zips, and then there's a like little buckle here, so it's pretty hard for anybody to like get into it without me noticing, so I like that, that it's just a little bit more secure, and there's also a pocket in the front to keep some extra little things. So in that front little pocket, I usually keep my toothbrush. It's just because if I ever feel like brushing my teeth at the airport or on a plane, like if I'm flying late or super early in the morning, then I like to have my toothbrush in there. And then I also have a pack of tissues. I have recently started to love Lara bars. So I have the cashew cookie one in here, a pen in case I need to fill out customs forms, and then also a nail file for obvious reasons. I currently have some Rolaids in here, which I also have Rolaids in another little baggy, but this is just from previous travels, so I have that in there. And then I also like to have mints or gum. I will be putting a pack of gum in here before I travel, but right now I still have mints from Pure. Obviously, the first essential is to have your passport. Every time I'm traveling, I make sure to put my passport in my carry-on bag like days before I travel just so that I make sure I'm not going to forget it. So that's always in here. And this passport is from a brand called My Tagalongs, and they sell that brand at places like Winners, home sense, things like that. I also have my iPad, and this is not an essential, but I definitely think it's useful to have some form of entertainment, whether it's a magazine or obviously your phone, which is another thing you should probably be bringing. The other thing I always have in my carry-on is my liquids bag, and if you are carrying any type of liquids, they have to fit inside a clear one quart zip top bag. I believe they can't be over 3.4 ounces each, so I think that's about 100 mils. So make sure everything is travel size or travel friendly if you are going to be traveling with a bunch of liquids. If I wasn't packing my makeup in my checked bag, I would put the liquid makeup products in this bag as well, but it will all be going in my checked bag. So this is just a few things that I like to have while I'm actually flying somewhere. This bag is, I think from Walmart, like when you get those little travel sets that have a bunch of things in it already. I got one for Christmas and I'm just reusing this bag because obviously it is the perfect size for traveling. So the first thing I have in my clear liquids bag is some toothpaste. I always like to have toothpaste with me while I'm in the air because if I want to brush my teeth before I get where I'm going, then I always have that available. And I found the travel size version of the Toms of Maine toothpaste and this is cruelty free. My favorite cruelty free toothpaste is from Hello but I don't know or don't think they have travel sizes. So I found this at Fred Meyer and I was super happy. I also really like to have poopery or some sort of like toilet spray in my bag when I travel because you never know and I feel like it's just really convenient to have. I don't know if it's cruelty free actually, I'm pretty sure it is, but I did find it at Ulta and they also have it at Target. I will always have lip balm with me every single time I travel. I have it with me every day anyways because my lips get dry pretty quickly and if you're on a plane, they get dry even more and I'm constantly reapplying my lip balm when I fly. So I like to have this in there. This one is from Skin Fix. It's my favorite brand for lip balm. I also like to have some sort of moisturizer. I have this mini sample that I got from StyleCon. It's from the brand 
brand Freedom and this is a calming moisturizer for redness and it's just like a facial moisturizer and I use this all the time. It is cruelty free and it feels really good to have a moisturizer available whenever you're flying because like I said the airplane air is very dry. I have a hand cream and if I just have like a general moisturizer I don't usually bring either of these but because I have two specific ones I just like to use this because again my hands get really dry and this one is from Aveda so I always like to have that with me. Because I've been traveling so much I definitely noticed that the air in the airplane really does mess my skin up so I'm bringing my favorite eye cream from Ole Hendrickson and this is the Banana Bright eye cream. I use it all the time. It's got kind of like a shimmery kind of look to it so it's very brightening but it also is super moisturizing so I figured it would be a good idea to bring it on the plane as well speaking of hydrating the under eye area I always travel with eye patches these ones are my favorite from Tarte they're called pack your bags 911 under eye rescue patches they're just gel eye patches that go underneath your eyes and they make the biggest difference. I love doing this when I travel, especially on longer flights. I also do like to bring perfume, not only for the flight, but when I get there and usually I only need a travel size of whatever perfume I'm bringing. And while I was in Coachella with Dote, they did have a little table with a bunch of Pinrose perfumes. It's a new perfume brand and they are cruelty free. And I decided to bring the Sun Saint perfume from Pinrose and I love their mini ones because it actually is a spray bottle instead of a roll-on so it's just a little bit easier to use and this one smells so good and so tropical so I thought it would be perfect for Hawaii the last things that I have in my liquids bag are my sage roller balls because I'm obsessed with them if you haven't heard of sage check them out I'm pretty sure they have stores all across North America but they're one of my favorite stores ever because they're like natural wellness these sage roller balls are some of my favorite things ever I use them all the time I use them at home but they are the perfect size for traveling with as well of course I will also have my wallets with ID and cash and anything that I might need because I'm extra when it comes to packing my carry-on bag I do like to keep everything in their own like little baggies so that I know where everything is it seems probably excessive but that's just what makes me feel better when I travel so in another bag that is not for liquids is where I like to keep sheet masks wet wipes and floss Deodorant. I just found this mini deodorant from Alba Botanica. It is the clear deodorant in tea tree and I got this at Fred Meyer. It's like the perfect size to travel with. I also have like little packets of painkillers in here in case I do need it or in case anybody else needs it. And I have this little pink spoolie for my eyelash extensions. I do get my lash extensions done by Wildfire Lash. You can check her out on Instagram because she's awesome. I also like to bring a sleeping mask because you never know when you might want to take a nap on the flight and maybe it's a little bright or something. And we are actually flying a red eye back home so I figured this would be good to have. I do have my vlogging camera and I'm keeping this in my little SL Miss Glam bag because it's so cute and it's the perfect size for these things. I also like to bring disposable cameras on trips. They're some of my favorite things to do because I love getting them developed when I get home. And about half of the photos are already taken from Coachella so I just want to use the rest up in Hawaii. This holds earbuds. It's also from the My Tagalongs brand, the same brand that my passport holder is from. So this just holds earbuds. I love to always have earbuds on the plane so that I can actually listen to my own iPad and I have the ones for my iPad and my iPhone as well as an extra lightning cable in case I need it. And to go along with the vlogging camera and everything I have a bag full of like battery chargers, extra cords, and little like cubes for charging your phone. One thing that I always travel with is an external battery that is fully charged so that I can use it whenever I need to and I really like this one. I don't exactly know what brand it is but it is from West Coast Vibes and I think that this was just a little promo thing they were handing out at StyleCon but it actually comes with its own like cord in here. And the last thing I have in my carry-on is this little baggie. This is from Milk Makeup. It came with a little like small travel size things that I bought a while ago. In here is where I keep daily medication. I also have this little thing full of Tums and Pepto tablets. I have band-aids and extra hair ties in here. And it's basically just a little mini emergency kit type thing for anything that I could possibly need. So that is everything in my carry-on bag. 
I feel like it probably seems very extra to a lot of people because I bring so many little things, but that's just how I like to travel. It makes me feel way better and more comfortable when I travel. And I also have really liked having everything in the little bags because I don't have to go digging through a ton of stuff, especially when I'm walking through an airport trying to get my passport or my IDs or money. So this just works for me. Maybe it'll help some of you guys out if you're looking for new ways to pack your carry-on bag or different things to bring. Let me know if you pack your carry-on similarly or if you are very different. Either way, whatever works for you is perfectly fine, but I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!